So in case you don't know, if you are a fan of CR Droid Custom Room because it's quite stable, it's quite smooth. I've also installed it on my, on my primary device, which is Google Pixel 8 Pro right now. And why I have installed this thing and why I am loving this build right now. Because like some other custom rooms right now, because they are bringing you some amazing things. And one of the amazing things actually is the support for the banking apps. Definitely with all the security checks passed, bootloader is locked and some more things like that. As you can see, CR Droid version is still 10.7. It's not 10.8 while making this video. That is also coming very soon, by the way. But it's having August security patch. The September security patch is also coming very soon. One of the main highlights of this custom room was the bootloader is locked. Yes, it is now it is spoofed to bootloader as locked, which means you'll be able to use all the banking apps. In my case, as I just told you, I'm using it on my device, which is Google Pixel 8 Pro as my daily driver. And I'm able to use some banking apps here in this case without having any issues. Let me show you the play integrity API checker now. As you can see, meets device integrity, absolutely fine, meets basic integrity and also meets the strong integrity right now while making this video. It's a very popular thing and available in many custom rooms right now. That's a very good thing. Other than else, here Droid, the late, this latest version, which is 10.7, which is already 10.7 from a long time because about the play integrity, this is a new update. That's why I just wanted to let you know. Else we have similar kind of things available there. The customization section, as you can see, all the options like status bar having similar kind of options available for you. If we move on to the quick settings panel, you will notice that we have the option for quick setting tile styles. The good thing about this one is the quick settings panel is quite smooth even if you use Android 11 style quick settings panel. I found in some of the custom rooms if you change it to Android 11 style the quick settings panel starts just lagging and jittery but in this case it's not like that. It's still quite smooth and CR Droid is always one of the most smoothest custom room with most of the updates. Lock screen, similar kind of options. There's nothing new to talk about in this update, actually. It's just about the safety, basically privacy options, some bootloader locked spoofing and play integrity spoofing. Nothing much. And that's actually a very useful thing, by the way. User interface has still same kind of options available for you. Fonts, icon packs, signal icons. One thing, let me tell you, CR Droid is not updated like some other custom rooms like Matrix OS or Rising OS, etc which means the disable flag secure, no storage restrict, hide screen capture status. Those amazing features aren't the part of CR Droid custom room. Even the most popular disable flag secure is also not available here. But definitely you can get those features with the help of some modules. But for that, you have to root your device. In this case, as you can see, play integrity spoofing option is also present here. And yes, it also supports the three finger custom gesture, which is a very useful thing. Three finger swipe by default. Previously, it was screenshot, but now from some previous updates, we have the option to customize it. You can choose other options in case you want to other actions if you want to perform them. So yes, these were the things I just wanted to let you know if you want to try this custom ROM on a device. If you're using any of the supported device, Android actually supports a lot of devices. If you want to try them, link is already there in the description. If you like this video, don't forget to drop a like. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe the channel. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care.